Hello. In this video, we'll be speaking on how to create a today extension. Today extension is commonly called as widget. Uh, it is something that we see when we pull on the notification bar. Say we have weather widgets and Facebook feeds widgets, all those things. So do remember widgets cannot be created as a standalone you know kind of uh, element it has to be embedded inside an application so we'll start with creating a new application so single view app is okay for me some random name for my app and I create once we create an application I then go and add a new target and this target will be to the extension but you see various number of extensions they all serve a different purpose unique purpose of course and so for today it is here i choose and give widget tutorial and finish and please notice once i create this target we'll see a new group automatically created with its own files it its own storyboard and info dot playlist i'll go ahead and open the storyboard so we see we already have a view controller and a view inside that and we also have a label i'll just change the color of this so that it is visible so we already have a label called hello world this storyboard is as simple as the application storyboard we can go ahead and create any number of labels any number of any ui views for that matter we can add an image a label text field button or anything that we want but for this tutorial i'm just leaving it as simple as that uh, le let us have this uh, you know automatically created label and see how it is getting displayed so i've created i've chosen the target uh, extension and i'll be running it on iphone 7 run uh, and please be sure we can we can also add constraints to the UI views that that uh, that is there and we can also add as many UI views that we need and this info dot playlist is very specific to the widget that we have created so this will have all the information that is specific to the widget and this is different from the apps info dot playlist you can very well see that as apps info dot playlist is somewhere here so here we got it so here we see widget tutorial i'll just run it again i don't see the label displayed aha uh -huh, some loading problem so here we have an edit option where i can choose all the say this was my earlier created widget i'll choose that too and okay it's, it's taking some time to get the text Oh, here we got I go edit and I remove the older one okay so this is the widget I created newly so we just see the basic label that we have chosen however you can choose to add image here or whatever you want for that case and this is all about how we create widget in simple terms so do like subscribe and comment thank you